During my sophomore year of college, I had just gotten off of work from working a 4 p.m. to midnight at a pizza shop. I lived at an apartment complex that was four stories with about 430 living spaces within it. So when I got there, I parked my car in the back of the building because it was closer to my apartment and everyone always fought to get these parking spaces, but I snagged one so I took it. As I started walking towards the steps to make my four-story climb since I lived on the fourth floor, a few feet before I reached the steps, I hear fast footsteps coming towards me. So I turned naturally to figure out what the noise was and my gaze fell on this dirty looking man running towards me with a knife. Fight or flight absolutely kicked in and I ran as fast as my legs could carry me up the steps. I did track for six years prior to this and was always one of the fastest so I was pretty confident I could outrun him. I heard him trample up the steps after me so once I hit the second floor I ran through that floor to the other side of the steps and started going upwards again. Luckily, I heard people out smoking on the third floor, so I ran towards them and parked myself there. As I was catching my breath from running as fast as I could, the people around me, which I did not know, just kind of looked at me like I was crazy, which, you know, is understandable. I probably looked insane. But as I was standing there, I decided to look at the floors below to see if I could find the man. And we locked eye contact. He shot me a menacing grin before calmly walking down the steps and going off into the darkness. I watched him intently as he faded into the shadows, and then I ran my ass all the way up to my apartment, locked the door, and collapsed on the floor, panicking and catching my breath. I grew very paranoid after this event, always clocking my surroundings and making sure there was no one there. But to this day, I never saw this man again. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this story, be sure to check out my other experiences on the channel and subscribe. Also, be sure to check out my social media accounts. With that being said, don't be afraid to be weird in a world that's so dull. And be safe out there. You never know what could happen.